Hey guys, welcome back to Nature's Cadence Farm. Uh, we're here on location at Granny's house today and uh, we're going to be working on our 2005 Dodge Grand Caravan again. Uh, so I'm having a problem with a vibration in the front when the air conditioning's running. So we're having a problem with the fan on the radiator. Uh, there's a broken piece of plastic and it's it's really making a vibration when the cooling fan for the radiator turns on and uh, So I've got a new fan in and uh, I've got my old fan here that I'm going to take out So let's go down here, and I'll show you kind of how it's going to come out so we're, at, we're at the front of the van here, and There's the the radiator fan in there, and it's really hard to see but right inside of here right where the tip of my finger is uh, right there yep there's a 10 millimeter bolt that needs to come out and then there's also one over here on the driver's side that was the passenger side uh, the driver's side is is down down behind right right past my fingertip right there and uh, it that there it is right there that's a 10 millimeter bolt as well and uh, what I've done here is I went ahead and disconnected the the electrical connectors off of here and the way those work is um, I'll show you on this one right here uh, there's a little red plug that goes through here and then you gotta push the back the very very back here and then pull it out from the electrical socket so uh, I'm gonna get in here I've got my my handy dandy Milwaukee 3 8 ratchet with a 10 millimeter socket on there and uh, let's see if we can get these guys out of here I might need some extensions or something I might be able to fish this thing in here yeah it looks like I'm gonna need an extension now what I ended up getting was a 3 inch extension on there and that looks like it's gonna fit perfect to zip these guys off. Yep, just like that. All right, so there's one. And we've got another one down inside of there. I had a little trouble getting uh, getting this guy out, but it wasn't a big deal. I just it wasn't difficult to get it out. I just had to uh, finagle the the ratchet kind of down in there. Not a big deal. So uh, the top here should hopefully come back. Okay, after some deliberating and conversations with the van. I ended up taking these, there are six number two Phillips screws that come out right here and they attach to this front part all along here and then there was two 10 millimeter bolts that went through here and two little plastic uh, push through thingies that went one there and one there and then this whole uh, plastic shroud came out. So it looks like next we have some 10 millimeter bolts to take out and these brackets to take off. It looks like I'm going to end up pulling all this forward after I got those brackets off. I'm going to take the hood latch assembly off so I can try to fish this fan right out through that hole. But this uh, lever here is going to get in my way. So let's get that out of the way. I got the old one out and uh, it took a little coaxing and um, persuasion but we ended up getting it out uh, so it kind of came out this way uh, you know it was down in there and I got this end up and then everything came out this way so I'm going to start with going back in like this with it uh, so this you know the radiator and everything moves really nicely and um, so we're going to slide this over B 
be careful with your hands. You can easily pinch them. All right, we got it down in there. Like I said, I'm not sure if that's how you're supposed to do it, but that's how I did it. Um, yeah, so there's some little clips down in here. Mr. Cameraman, can you get down in here so I can show where these clips are? Right around and right down inside of there. You have to step around the side. So right down inside of here, where my finger's wiggling, there's a little U-shaped clip like that, and this straight blade on the uh, on the fan just snaps down in there, and that'll get it lined up. And there's two, one on each side. So now that one's in. Oh yeah, and this one's in. Oh look, it just fell right in there. Did you see that? So I got everything lined up. This top clipped in. The bottom fell in, and uh, yeah, and uh, we're ready to put all this back together. Uh, there's a little plastic holder thingy that uh, went into there. It goes back into here. Put that in there. That holds that in place. And uh, let's see here. Yeah, so all that goes goes back like that. Something like that. <clears throat> well, we'll start with what we took off last. We'll put this guy back on. There's some little uh, holders. These two guys here go back in. Oh, that's two different sides. We'll go with these smaller ones. Oh, no. We'll go with the bigger ones. What I'm looking at here is the old dirty part left on this hood latch. It's the larger ones. There we go. Just gonna get them started by hand and then run them up with the uh, with the ratchet. in there what was the next thing we did what do we take these these little brackets off here these guys here something like that yeah there we go so. that was these other 10 millimeter bolts like that's in there real nice all right what's next uh, we gotta put our little 10 millimeter bolts back in the fan while we got all that apart so here's these guys right here
go ahead and plug in these connectors while we're while we're at it. This one's real easy to get to. There we go. Don't forget your little red holder thing in there. Oh, what's next here? We've got this guy here. This goes in underneath of all this and over all this. How did that thing come out of there? Maybe, maybe like that. That looks about right. Yeah. Right. I've got my five screws here and my Phillips. We're just going to go easy on these because this is just plastic. Up here we had uh, these little plastic guys and uh, what they did is they went down through here and then pressed in and then one over here. Now that's the front one not the back one toward the front of the vehicle because the back one takes the 10 millimeter bolts. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, that was actually a really fairly easy job. Um, I'll tell you what, let's fire this thing up and uh, let's listen to how the fans sound. I should have showed you what the other one sounded like, but trust me, it was vibrating really bad. So, In fact, I can show you right here. This is what happened. So, let's see, the way this thing was in here, like that, this side over here was vibrating. And what happened was this whole this piece right here just snapped, broke. I'm not sure just from wear and tear or what happened, but once that thing got to spinning really fast to help cool this thing down, it was it was making a racket. So it's all right. Got that. Uh, yeah. So let's clean up the tools a little bit, and we'll start it up and warm it up, and then um, see how they sound. We got the van started up, the fans are running, uh, I got the air conditioning turned on, it's really easy to make your fans turn on. Uh, so they're running, it's nice and smooth, not vibrating the van anymore, and uh, yeah, I'm happy. Thanks for watching, and we will see you next time. Thank you for so much for watching. 
What's the matter with you? <laughs>